welcome to Sunday's edition of Matt's Nam 13. Hi everyone. All right then, what we got for you today? Uh, let's have a look at some more wrestling randoms for you. Today it's superhero wrestlers. Superheroes of wrestling. Uh, we have 13 wrestlers, not sure why 13, maybe they're closing there, uh, we have, that have appeared in pro wrestling uh, dressed as superheroes. Uh, pretty terrible ideas most of them, but they're just funny in most cases. So. Number one on our list is Super Stacy, also known as St Stacy Keebler. She wrestled on Bill's character on 2005-2006 and was part of a three person group, which we'll talk about next. Yes we will. She had a feud with Victoria. Uh, but she mainly played a manager on the sidelines role at this point, uh, but she was soon drafted over to SmackDown to the left. But the second person in this group was Superhero in Training, Rosie. Or if you use the first letter of Superhero in Training, you end up with... Yes. Uh, he spent most of his time trying to prove himself and finally got his break and become World Tag Team Champions with... Well, Lido was leads the group and probably the most famous on this Superhero list. Uh, Hurricane. Yes, who has a win over the Rock to his name and was the longest cruiserweight champion, I think, in history. Wow. Okay, next up we have Super Eric, a character played by Eric Young when he was on Impact Wrestling uh, and joined a, a group called the Prince uh, Justice Brotherhood. A parody of the Justice League. Yeah, that's never quite a... Indeed, and another member was... Uh, oh yeah. Shark Boy. He made his debut on TNA in the August of 2002. He also took the mickey out stone colds, beer drinking and dicks by drinking clam juice. Yes, clam juice. Never tried it? Uh, I know. Another member of this group was Curry Man, who was played by now AEW wrestler Christopher Daniels. As no first wrestler in WWE as a power ranger like character called Avatar? Avatar, yeah. Okay. Never heard of him. Anyway, next we have the Toxic Turtles, who only had one match in WWE. The, they didn't have proper names like the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, but their names were Tommy and Terry. Tommy and Terry. Yeah, it was probably a, uh, a lawsuit waiting to happen, so they scrapped that straight away. Another famous name, Mr. America. Mr. America. Just can't work out who this is. Uh, comment down below if you know. Hulk Hogan was going to pick this character, as Vince McMahon was trying to kick, kick off Hulkamania and run down Hogan's character act. Yeah, so um, yeah. does anybody remember the uh, Mariner? Nope, nor me. No, it was played by Bruce the Barber Beefcake. Oh, yeah, sure, no. Uh, yes, uh, Bruce Barber Beefcake. Apparently, he made three appearances as his character or so, attacking heels after their matches in the early 90s, just after his, his power saying accident, so obviously face masked up. Now we have Batman. Batman? What? The actual Batman is going to be wrestled? Yeah, kind of. Tony Marino played a Batman, spelt with two T's in 1966, but in 1970 uh, it was it was phased out. Okay, never mind. Well, what's next? Spider-Man? Spider-Man. Well, sort of, actually. We had Arachnaman in WCW, played by Brad Armstrong. This character was quickly dropped uh, after a few months or so, as Marvel Comics threatened legal action. Uh, another famous one for you now. Uh, who is it? The late, great Owen Hart played the character Blue Blazer when he first joined WWE in 1988. Yeah. He was the only used as a mid card wrestler and he left for New Japan Pro Wrestling soon after. Yeah, and obviously he returned and had a great career as we all know. Uh, but he did kind of return as Blazer in 1999 and a feud with Jeff Jarrett would later become, and they would later become tag champs. There was a funny storyline when Owen claimed he wasn't the Blue Blazer, appearing next to Jeff Jarrett dressed as Blue Blazer. Jarrett yeah, Jeff Jarrett then denied he was a new blazer, so both of them stood next to another man in the costume, which was none other than Coco Beware. Uh, you should go and check this out. Um, how many times did I say blue blazer in that sentence? I don't know. Don't know. So there you go. Uh, a little look of superheroes of wrestling. Uh, yeah, there's, there's probably some more. Comment down below if you know any more. Yeah, please do. Just what comment down. Said? Yeah, there must be some more random ones out there. So um, yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. We ain't far from our. 100 subscribers now, which is brilliant. Like the quality, yeah. Yeah, quality. So, uh, stay safe. Bye. Bye.